Hello and welcome to Mark and Kelly's Trips, Tips and Things. So today we're going to do something a little bit different. We are. We have done an order of the German kebab. So... Mm, something mm. new, isn't it? So mm. basically, we what we wanted to do is do a few more reviews of takeaways. We haven't done this um, at all in our video, so this is a new thing we want to do. So the German kebab, here we go, German Donner kebab, that's their logo. And this is one of the things I've ordered. Uh, where they, they're sort of based around central London, aren't they? Yeah, they're based all over. Mm. Yeah. And um, they do a different range of kebabs. Now, of course, everyone's familiar with kebabs. These are slightly different, I feel. These are actually good quality ones. Not mm. saying that all kebabs aren't good quality, but we wanted to show you how we feel about these kebabs. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I really enjoy these kebabs. Mm, so do I. Yeah. So what we got? Do you want to go through them? All right, I'll open this one. So this is, I think this is my one, isn't it, you ordered? Yeah, this is the veggie kebab. Here we are. So they come in a little box and in foil as well. Let me just see if I can adjust this camera just That's a little fine. bit. Okay. Right. And what I like about these ones as well, they are quite chunky. So you get this, if I just unwrap that there, you get the good wedge of bread. Look at that. Open it up a little bit more. So in this, it's like it's almost like you've got a huge chunk of bread there. Go behind there. There it is. It's focusing. Uh, if I open it up, you can see that that's got the veggie patty in the middle, and then you've got all your salads on top. Now I really like this kebab. There's something about it. It's really chunky. It's really and it's actually good value. That's about a tenner, as you can see there. So for the big patty, and obviously your your veg on top as well. Yeah. All right. I mean the whole thing that we ha that we ordered came to about thirty five pounds, um, and I ordered a whole range of things. So. Um, Mark wanted the uh, curry fries. There we are. So they're regular, like they, they almost look like McDonald's chips, but they're actually regular fries, but they've got the curry sort of powder on them. And these are quite tangy. I do like these. Got a very sort of subtle curry flavour to them. And then I ordered uh, flaming fries. So very similar to our regular fries. We'll get out of the way so it can uh, focus. But these are these are quite hot. They've got a nice sort of chilli tang to them. Yeah, they're, they're a bit more redder than the um, than the curry fries. These are the chilli cheese bites. Chilli cheese. So mac and cheese in crispy crumb coating. Yeah, it's like, um, not quite mac and cheese, I would say, mm. but more like, a, you know, the, the nacho cheese that you get. So it's like the nacho cheese that's in there with a, mm. a, a jalapeno pepper in. Yeah. I think that's more rather than, like, you wouldn't get pasta in it or anything like that. But you get what he's trying to say, um, like what Mark's trying to say. What did you get there? Um, I then got a um, chicken burger. So basically, um, I bought a, a gym box with normal Donner meat, which we'll show you. But I wanted to try one with chicken meat because I've not tried chicken meat before. I mean, chicken meat from the German Donner. So, wow. I think you opened it the wrong way. No, because it was right that way. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. So, I don't know if you can see that. We're going to show you in a second. It's a bit... No, no, no! There's a lot to it. Yeah. All right. I'm just trying to find a little bit of space. Okay, I don't know. No, you're not going to let me hold it. Yeah, because it's going to just drop, yeah. There we are. So if we move out of the way, there you go. So if, essentially, it's it looks like it's chicken donut in a uh, in a roll. There it is. It's focusing now. So if you like your chicken donut, so almost like a chicken donut burger. Yeah, in, in yeah in a burger essentially. Yeah. So I've not tried the chicken one before. I've tried the meat one before, but I haven't tried the chicken one. So I'm really interested in trying that. And what's the other thing we got? Um, and then um. I've got, let me just pop that over there. So with the, um, cause it was like a kid's meal. So with that, it came, uh, sorry, it came with chips, which are right here or fries, however you want to say, but that's just normal fries. There's no, um, flavorings to it at all. It's just normal fries. And then 
with that you also could choose a drink and so the drink that i went for was fanta but everybody knows what fanta looks like but i don't know if you want to grab the can and no i think everyone can see everyone fanta. knows what fanta looks like just in case you've never seen a fanta before there it is so yeah so you've got burger fries and fanta which i thought was quite good value it was about 5.99 okay um and then i got this this was the gym box if you can see that there so what's in here? It looks like just a roof of salad. Basically, it's salad with meat. Okay. And I took out the tomatoes and I got extra onion. There we because are. Because I love onions. Right. There we go. It looks like one of those uh, American Chinese takeaway boxes. Yeah, yeah, it does. Right. So let's... I'm just going to tip it all out. So there we are. We're going to go sample this. One of the other things as well, they are very, very generous with their sauces. You can't see all the ones down here, but they give us all these little pots of sauces. You've got chilli sauce, like a Greek garlic sauce. And they also do another one, which is my favourite, which is one with dill in it. So you've got, this is the one with dill, this is the one with Greek uh, garlic, and this is the one with, um, sorry, yoghurt, and this is the one with the chilli one. And they've, they've given us about 10 pots down here. Yeah. We've got quite a lot, so I think they've just bunged them all in. Now, one thing while Kelly's doing that is we also find is sometimes when you get your order, the chips are all spewed out at the bottom. That does happen. We did have a slight casualty um, with the chilli ones. Uh, sorry, with the curry ones. Yeah, because they fell out all over the bag. But here we are. Oh, look at that. So that's yeah. the German meat. Let me hold that up so the camera can see. Yeah. So basically, I forgot to say I also ordered extra meat. Wow, look at that. And to order extra meat was like one pound something that is a substantial meal so yeah i'm just trying to get down so that's that. right that's right it's focusing oh good there we are so as you can see it's quite a a big meal so uh, we wanted to sort of try this test it out mark doesn't eat meat um i'm certainly not going to eat all of this but i will sort of maybe throughout the day sort of chomp on it right let's go so i'm going to try these are the curry fries. Mmm. That's really good. Got that. It's almost like they've got the chilli. Do you want to try it? It's almost like they've got the curry powder on them. Yeah. Not not hot. Don't mm, you? No. A slight spice. But they're good. Yeah. I like those. The spice is very slight. Mmm. Mmm. You can also order plain chips. If spice is not your thing, you can order plain. It's not a problem. The fries are good. Mm. Okay. I'm not going to bother taking this one, but go for your meat. The meat. So this is the donna. And what I say, I can see from here, the shavings are very, very thin. Mm. Now, I know from my days when I used to eat meat, this is about 20 years ago, that the shavings always used to be quite thick from, mm. from memory, but they are quite thin. What's it like? It's really, really tasty. So flavourful. Is it lamb? It's beef, I think. Oh, okay. It's beef, yeah, it's not lamb. But it's really nice. I really, really love the flavours in it. It looks juicy. There's, mm. a, there's a sheen all over it. Mm. So how would you rate that from other kebab places you've had? Sorry. Um, okay. Meat wise, one of the best ones. Hey, oh wow, really? One of the best ones, yeah, meat wise, yeah. Oh wow. It's so flavourful. It's so toasty. And the reason why I like these is well, they got a good really good hygiene mating. The hygiene mating was five. Mm. That always impresses me, mm. I think. I remember you saying that before. Yeah. Right, so we've tried that. You tried that. Let what should we try? Should we try? Do you want to try a um, flaming fry? Right, let's try a flaming fry. So these are the hot ones. Mmm, that's got real. <laughs> that's got a kick. Really? I like it. Though. It's not. It's not mega hot. Oh, I can feel it now. That's got that real after kick of chili. Ooh. That's good. They are good, actually. And I do like... Do you know what? I do like the spice ones. When you have the plain ones afterwards, 
Um, I do find the plain ones a bit boring. They've got to go with something, either a sauce or a dip. Um, but these ones you can eat on their own. Yeah, the, the, they're spicy, but I don't feel they're that spicy. Maybe I'm a wuss, but I got that real aftertaste. Yeah, food. they're spicy. They are spicier than the curry fly. Curry flies? Curry fries. But I find that the curry fries are very mild. And I find this just slightly above that. But to me, it's mild. It's not. Mmm, that's good. Mmm. I'm just adding another one there, that's that kick. Mm. Right, now I'm going to try the bites, okay? Ooh. The cheese bites. Mmm. Now, I don't know if you can see in that. Let's hope it's going to focus. I'm going to try and get it to focus in. There we are. But inside there, if that will focus. Come on, camera, you can do it. Oh, focus, 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 focus. Ah, there we go, got it. So inside there is, it's like Kelly says, it's almost like nacho cheese. So it's got a really cheesy taste, and then you've got fries. So it's almost like cheese, nacho cheese, uh, surrounded by a crispy uh, crumb. Not crispy crumb, what would you say? That's sort of like a batter. Yeah, batter. crispy batter. Yeah. No, very good. You can tell that's unhealthy, but that is so mm. good. Do you want to try one? I'm all right with this one now. Okay. I have tried the cheese bites before. But yeah, they and I are... do like them. But I wouldn't I wouldn't eat too much of them. It's almost like they, they actually got jalapenos in there. I didn't see mm, that before. Mm. Tiny little flecks of jalapeno in there. Mmm. That's what gives them the chili flavour, the chili cheese bites. Now I'm gonna do the dip with one of the sauces. So this is my favourite one. This is the one with dill in it. Really like them. I shouldn't have eaten all my chips. <laughs> Ta-da! Have oh. the plain ones. These will be better actually because they've got less flavour on them. Mm. You can have the real taste of the sauce then. Mm. That sauce is really good. Definitely recommend using that dill sauce. Now using that, I'm going to dip it in one of the chilli sauces. Try that one. And I'm going to eat away. Mmm. Again, that chilli sauce is really good. It's not really hot. Oh, is that chilli sauce as well? Yeah, mm, try that. Well. It's not really hot. So I don't normally eat the sauces. Oh, I love the sauces. That's the, the, I must say, German kebab do really, really good sauces. Try that sauce. It's it's not really, it's not like sriracha strong, but it's it's got a good kick to it. It does have a good kick to it. Um... But there's something about it. I don't know if it's the fact that it might be too sweet or too tomatoey. Really? Yeah. No, I like that. The garlic one. Mm, that is quite garlicky. Try that one. That's got a real garlic kick to it. So it's yogurt and garlic. So as I say, my favourite is the dill one. The one with dill is delicious. But that one's alright. But it is very garlicky. It would, it would go with your meat, actually. Mmm. This tastes like a creme fraiche to me. Mmm, yeah. A creme fraiche with yeah. um, garlic in it. It's definitely a yoghurt or a creme fraiche or something. Yeah. It doesn't taste like a yoghurt. These natural bites. With that yeah. jalapeno. <laughs> That's good. It's almost a sauce in itself. I mean... I was wrong. So I thought it was mac and cheese, but it's a mac and cheese type um, sauce. Yeah, it's the mac and cheese sauce. So like a, a nacho cheese sauce um, with jalapenos, deep fried. Just to confirm, there's no macaroni in this. No. And there's no pasta in it. Mmm. Mmm, that will look good. Mmm. I'll dip it in my dill. Mmm. Even better. <laughs> if that is at all possible. I really, I mean, I just feel that the meat is so flavourful. Mmm. And the fries are good too. Even the plain ones, mm. I've got a really good taste of them. They're not very salty, like you would get with McDonald's ones. But they're bigger than McDonald's. So, but go on. What I love, like, whenever I'm eating kebab or 
something like that. I like to get meat with a salad, but there's not very many places where I will eat a salad. I'll make a salad at <clears> home <throat> and all that, but there aren't very many restaurants. I think, oh God, yeah, I really need to get a salad from this place. There's only a couple of places. Now there, look, I opened it one way and I'm gonna open it the other one. That's where wow. I thought there wasn't that much lettuce in there, but there you go. Look, you've got all that red cabbage in there. It's like a ginormous uh, veggie patty. That's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna give this a go, and it's in a huge slice of bread. Is there pickle in there? Because I ordered. Pickle? Oh, you did. Yeah. yeah. I don't see any pickle in here. There might be. No, there's no pickle in oh. here. Oh. I ordered pickle in there. They're normally quite good. I mean, it's a ginormous yeah, it's patty. Yes, very it's huge. big. Right. Okay. Here we go. So as you can see here, I've got big hands. That's a big thing. Hmm. That patty's really good. If you're vegetarian, this would be definitely one to go for. Um, the patty's almost like it's got mushed vegetables. Mm. And that's almost like it's been fried with it. It's got a little crust to it as well. As I enjoy that. Not everyone likes veggie patties, I've got to say. Veggie burgers obviously vary. But that one I really enjoy. And that is definitely going to fill you up. Mm. That size of that. That with chips. I've got to say, with the onions and the sa Oh my goodness. It's so good. Mm. So we do like to do regular um, takeaways. And we do, we're thinking to ourselves, well, we should film this. Mm. And give you ideas as well. And obviously if you want to share ones with us. We're happy to share. Mm. Right, okay. There's one thing you've got to try. Well, I, excuse me. Take more chili fries. Bye-bye. That's -bye. quite a big burger. That is quite a big burger. Now, remember, I've not had the chicken before, so this will be my first time trying the chicken. You can get different combinations, like, um, if you want just like meat, like if you just want a regular donor and, and all of that type of stuff, they actually do um, mixed ones. So you can have chicken, um, chicken and beef, like just plain beef or just plain chicken or mixed chicken and beef. It's up to you. They're really good. But, um, but it's only the two meat combinations that they do. You can even get um, uh, spring rolls, oh. like uh, um, with the beef. Um, so the beef spring rolls, you can't, they, I've not seen them do it with the chicken ones, but I have seen them do it with the beef ones. Um, they also do a crunch burger. I've not had the crunch burger before, but I believe it's with nachos in the burger, which is what makes the crunch. Mm, I have a go then. So with the chicken, mm. it does look tasty. Well, yeah. I say I've not seen it as a veggie, but it does look, uh... It looks lovely. Here we go, so you can take a bite. So, um, <clears throat> as I was saying very similar to other kebab places but we we do think this is a slight not upgrade but it is a good quality mm. kebab so how is it, mm. it look, you say i can hear you chewing on it. it it just it does sound juicy the bun is really soft mm. the chicken is really juicy it's not dry chicken it's tender wow it's really good. How would you rate it then from other chicken burgers you've had? So for, say if you were to compare it to a normal chicken burger. Yeah, but normally when I have chicken burger, I don't normally have it like a grilled one or whatever. The normal chicken burgers that I have are normally always coated. Oh, okay. So this is the first time because I normally don't like chicken like this. Um, I like it. So if I was going to have a chicken burger, I want it to be like in some type of a batter or a crumb coating or something like that. Um, Cause that's how, for me, that's in my mind, that's a traditional chicken burger. The only time I have like um, chicken breast or anything like that is if I'm having a club sandwich, then it will be chicken and then it'll be bacon mm. and stuff like that. But yeah, this is really good. Yeah, I can see you chowing down on that. Well, there we are, we've tried all of them. Mm. Um, I'm gonna go for another one of these fries actually in the chili sauce. Mmm, that's really good. 
I think over and all, because we've, we've ordered from German Kebab um, a few times as well. And I've got to say, it's really good value for money as well, mm. I think, as well. Now, bear in mind, I know we, we've spent about 35 quid here, but there's a lot of food. More than enough for us. We wanted to get a selection. We, mm. Believe it or not, we wouldn't normally order this much for ourselves. But we no. wanted to get a bigger selection so you could see what's available. Yeah. And um, for £35, we um, enlarged both meals. Oh, yeah, of course, so, yeah, the large, yeah. Yeah. And then you added dill pickle, but although you haven't seen the dill pickle in there. So th this is what we get for £35. Four fries, two of them being flaming fries, one of them being curry fries and the other one being plain. Chicken burger, a large gym box, which is um, extra meat, extra onions, uh, minus the tomato. And um, with your one, it was a large chicken sandwich with um, extra pickle yeah, and extra tomatoes. Did yeah. there was no tomatoes in yeah, there? Yeah, there's tomatoes, oh, there's in, tomatoes there. in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, plus the chili cheese bites and a Fanta. It's not bad. It's not bad. That's not bad at all. So you'll get a good substantial meal. We Also as well, they're available, is it both Deliveroo and Just Eat? Yeah, both through Deliveroo and Just Eat. Now, if you want to make it, you know, inexpensive, you could just go for the burger. Mm. You know, if you just wanted to go for two burgers, you don't have to enlarge anything. You can just have it. Back. I mean, they run about five ninety nine per sort of burger so 5.99 and some 6.99 can't go wrong you can't go wrong That's i feel really good meal so and it's substantial it's not a little mm. that's a substantial burger and it came with chips and a drink um because we've ordered so much they've chucked in loads and loads of sauces loads of so, sauces they uh, must have thought that three or four people were eating <laughs> So it's your German kebab. If you're watching, thank you very much. We do appreciate thank that. Thank you, yeah. And remember, we this is our own opinion. We don't get sponsored. Um, we don't get paid for anything. We are not asked to review anything. This is solely done by us. Exactly. So we will give you our honest opinion on it. Very much like we did with our Starbucks review. Mm. With all our reviews. Mm. There we are. So good. I know. I don't need more of this shit, so let me just grab one of these. So I'm going to go with the curry fries again. And I'm going to go for my favourite sauce. Now, I've had one pot already, so I'm going for my second thing of dill. I call it dill. I don't know what it's actually called, but it has dill in it. Mmm. Oh, that's really good. And these chilli cheese bites as well. Mmm. I thought, why is it called chicken? And of course, yeah, he's got the jalapeno in it. He's got the jalapeno, yeah. But are they spicy? Mmm. Do you mean they're not spicy? No, they're not hot, hot, no. Yeah. They've got a slight um, spice to them, but... Considering they are jalapeno or jalapeno peppers, however you want to pronounce them, they're not hot. No. To, to, by my, they're not hot at all. No. No, um... No, I've had pizzas with jalapeno peppers on them, and they're much spicier. Yeah. But, no, that's good. Mmm, so good. Anyway, we're going to chow down and finish this food, mm. this big mountain of food that we've got, <laughs> and we're going to enjoy. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you uh, want us to try any other different types of takeaway that you fancy, please drop it in the comments below. We'd be happy to oblige, mm. providing we obviously deliver to us, of course. Of course. Um, but anyway, thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate your support. As always, please like, share and subscribe this video. And as always, you're never too old to have fun. There you go. Exactly. All right. We'll see you in the next video. Take care for now. Bye for now.